All right, we're going to take questions for Santi now. We'll start with Mike and Ryan Schumper. Yeah, Santi, when you're playing in a game like that and a team just isn't missing, even when you're scoring the way you guys were early, how, how hard is that to kind of keep your mentality in the right place as, as a team just keeps scoring? I mean, it's definitely hard. Um, I think they played a really good game. Uh, we knew they have really good guards, uh, good players. And all we could do is just keep cheering, cheering each other up, uh, have each other's back, and just try to keep fighting. What's the lesson that you guys have learned these last two weekends and these kind of lopsided uh, road losses? Uh, definitely that playing on the road is a lot harder than playing home. And uh, just figuring out what the team needs uh, from each one of the players. Uh, we're still learning. And I think it's only going to get better from now. And yeah, that's it. David Pascal and Grant. Santi, there was a point about six minutes into that second half where Washington and Wheeler were like a combined 15 of 17 from the floor. Had you have you ever experienced kind of a game like this where where opposing guards just were not missing? I mean, like I said, we knew they had good players. Uh, they starting to feel good. Uh, they were making shots. The crowd got them going too, and it was really hard to stop them. Both of them are uh, quick guards, and they can score the ball. So it's just hard to play whenever they're feeling good like that, and the crowd gets them going too. So it's hard to take any positives away from that game, but do you guys take any positives away from the way the, the offense made shots and, and put some points on the board? Uh, basically, that yeah, we got to stay together, and even on the tougher on the tougher times like right now. Uh, we get to stick together even more. We can't just get all separate each other, uh, everybody on their island. We got to just stick together. That's the main takeaway. Wes and Ben. Santi, are you concerned at all that, that the team might do that, that the team might start to struggle a, a little bit? Because I, I know y'all didn't come to Tennessee to, to have games like today and, you know, be two and three in SEC play. Uh, not worried. Uh, we're going to learn from that. We're going to get better. So, Santi, I know you said that you felt like Kentucky just kind of got hot and was making everything, but did you see anything schematically, X's and O's wise, that went wrong for y'all defensively? Could you repeat that, please? Just, just kind of what went wrong defensively. I, I know you said you felt like Kentucky was just making a bunch of shots, but – was there something that you all weren't doing uh, in addition? Uh, when you, uh, especially their guards, were going to be good. Uh, and they showed it tonight. They were fast. Uh, they were making shots. And I think pretty much that they were all making shots. So just got to know. And it's just hard to play against those kind of guys when they get it going right now. Uh, and the crowd gets them going too. Last two, Ryan and Reese. Do you feel like player leadership is a weakness for this team right now? Uh, no, definitely. I don't think it's a weakness. Uh, and I think this moment, uh, it's going to help us even more to find out uh, who's going to step up in that role. We have a lot of players doing it. And I just think that we're going to get better in that aspect, too. And this other times that we're going to learn even more. Santi, Coach Barnes said that Brandon Huntley Hatfield has had a change in attitude in the past two days. Have you seen that change in attitude and what has been different with him? He definitely had a uh, different attitude. Uh, in practice, you can see him uh, engage every single time. He was trying to play hard every single play. Also, he was working out with uh, coaches uh, on his own, and he was doing really good on that too. So I think he definitely had a different approach in that show tonight. Uh, I think in the minutes that he had, he shot a lot. and. He showed also a lot to himself, how he can import, uh, how can he help a lot in that way uh, to this team. Thank you, Santi. Thank you.